Thank you for joining me for part three of Caribbean Breeze Rag Rug. Um, the other two showed you how to get started and we talked about the details of this rug. This is what we are working on. Um, part two transitioned from one color to the other and showed you how to do that. And this is part three and this is going to just show you how to finish this rug. So this is the Caribbean Breeze Rug. Very simple little rug. We start with 48 stitches. But let me show you how we're going to end it. This is how far we got in the end of um, part two and I'm just going to show you quickly how to finish this. I don't want to leave you without the information that you need in order to complete this rug. We're going to use a tapestry needle. Tapestry needle has got a dull rounded edge, very nice little needle with a wide, a wide uh, hole up there on the top. Make sure that you get a metal one and that you don't get a, I don't know if you can see that, uh, don't get a plastic one because uh, they don't seem to do very well and uh, if you force it too much you'll end up breaking them so I always get a metal one. Um, we used a number 10 or an end needle on this project. So you're going to, I usually fold it over and I will take the tail and I'm going to show you how to weave it in whether it's the end of the rug over there when you've completed it or the end of the rug at the beginning. Now we'll show you something here. I noticed, I've noticed this before. See how this kind of is a little bit uneven? If we're going to force this back in and we're going to do it like this, that's going to, we're going to be feeding it down here. That's going to be pulling on this corner. So we're going to avoid that. All we're going to do, this is a very simple technique. I'm going to try to feed it in up here, which will balance this. These are little things that will make your rug just look a little bit better. All you're going to do is kind of try to weave it in to a couple different places as you go. Okay, and see, I'm not even happy with that because it didn't take care of my problem that I thought I had a little bit. So I'm going to pull this back out and you see how easy this is to do. This is real. I'm trying to show you that there is, even someone who does it a lot, you may have to make adjustments, and that's life. I want you to feel like uh, you, you know, you're just normal like everybody else if you have to fix it a little bit, okay? So I'm going to come back up, and I'm going to feed it in up here instead, okay? I'm going to feed it up here because I think that's going to make a better transition. All right, so I just found a place that would allow me to go in. I like the look of that a little better. Okay, now we're going to just feed it in. There we go. We're going to keep feeding it in. Now, see how you're going to ha come across this color? You're going to need to be careful that you're hiding it and not going over the top somewhere when you have a different color going on. So I'm going to feed that in down here. Just kind of got to find a place where it will let it go. All right. Now, I am going to, I would do this a little bit farther than I'm doing it now. I really tend to do it pretty far. But let me show you, actually this is something that I've figured out along the way that I feel like it makes it a little more secure. It's okay, we've gone this way. Now I'm going to turn it around and I'm going to seat it in going the other way. Just make sure you don't go in the same hole. There we go. Okay, then what you're going to do is you're going to give it an extra little tug so you hide your tail, kind of pull it a little tight. So I've kind of pull, put a little tension on it. You're going to cut it off, then just pull it and it pops right back in. So there you go.
you see how to finish it. You can do it the same way when you've completed the rug. So remember, if you're just watching this as your first part, go back and watch part one and two of Caribbean Breeze. And this is what we've worked on. Thank you for joining me, and subscribe. Thank you.